Hello, all you healthy blood pressure warriors. My name is Ingrid, and I want to welcome you to the HealthyBloodPressure.com channel. Do you struggle with taking your blood pressure medications on a consistent basis? Are you frustrated with how expensive your medications are? Wouldn't it be amazing if all you had to do was to take an injection that could help control your high blood pressure? Well, today I'm going to talk about potential vaccines for high blood pressure. You may have been given several vaccines as a child. You may also have gotten shots during your growing up years or early adulthood. Most of these vaccines were to keep you safe from certain types of diseases. But now there's research going on to develop vaccines to help control your high blood pressure. Research on a vaccine for high blood pressure isn't a new thing. Scientists have been looking for vaccine solutions for high blood pressure since the 1980s. Vaccine techniques were not very advanced during those times, and so they didn't have much progress. But now, with modern scientific methods, scientists are beginning to see some interesting results. In fact, researchers at Japan's Osaka University were some of the first groups to begin work on a blood pressure vaccine. The researchers of Japan conducted some initial trials of their vaccine on rats. The effect of the vaccine lasted for about six months. Unfortunately, this doesn't mean that it will last as long in humans. It could be more or less than six months. But even if it's slightly less than that, it could make a difference in the quality of life of high blood pressure patients. So far, only a few clinical studies showed promising results. Several teams from China lowered blood pressure in rats in separate studies. In Switzerland, scientists conducted a phase two trial on humans. In those vaccine trials, they found a significant reduction in blood pressure. They also claimed that the effects could last up to four months. Some other potential vaccine solutions have also come to the forefront in the last decade. These include teams from various parts of the world. The UK, France, China, and Switzerland are among those countries. With a number of countries researching the high blood pressure vaccine, we can see that the pace of vaccine research has been picking up worldwide. These vaccines could make a huge difference to the healthcare system of developing countries if the trials are successful. This is because long-term treatment of high blood pressure is expensive. There's also the burden of the drug delivery system of such countries to consider. So most high blood pressure patients aren't able to afford their blood pressure meds, and many countries find it really difficult to even get the medications. Those with high blood pressure either fall behind on medication or don't comply with the necessary lifestyle changes. That's why so many people with high blood pressure aren't able to treat their condition consistently with medications. And because so many people aren't treating their high blood pressure condition, it often leads to a lot of deaths from heart disease or stroke. If we had a successful blood pressure vaccine, we would have more people taking it, which would dramatically increase the heart health of so many people around the world. Ongoing research on a vaccine for hypertension may produce better results in the future. But until then, continue to follow your doctor's advice. Don't skip your meds and monitor your blood pressure regularly. Eat a heart healthy diet and exercise well. Work with your doctor to maintain compliance until a safe vaccine is available. Hi there, if you suffer from high blood pressure like I do, and you want to receive my educational videos about how to lower your blood pressure, I'd like to ask you to do three simple things right now. Number one, click the subscribe button right there. And then number two, click on the bell icon right down there so that I can notify you the moment I release a new video. And number three, watch another one of my more popular healthy blood pressure videos right over there. Okay, thanks for watching and have a happy and healthy day.